Hello everyone, Namaskar. I'm very happy to see nowadays senior citizens, elders in our channel. I always respect, I always wish to have the company of elders because I can learn a lot more things. Anyway, thank you everyone for your good wishes and blessings, for following our channel also and uh, by keeping you all in my mind I'm preparing this topic this is life principles after 40 years the life starts actually after 40 years only all kind of problems all these things how do we handle it simple five principles i'm going to share with you please note down so by the way my name is dr devika bhatnagar soft skills trainer and motivational speaker what are those five areas First area is that you have to focus on exercises or yoga because after 40 years some kind of problem starts like uninvited problems, diabetes, BP, cholesterol, heart problem and stomach related problems, bones problems, all these things uninvited problems it will attack slowly like a slow poison. How do we prevent it? How do we make ourselves very strong? Because of preparing with exercises. A strong body you have to make. Strong body, strong mind. It is possible with exercises and yoga. Take out daily one hour time. Out of 24 hours. Rest of the 23 hours are yours. One hour. I do. Really I go for walking for at least 20 to 30 minutes. Then after that one hour yoga I do. Yoga and uh, some breathing exercises, eye exercises, tapping of the body, all together to say package, complete package, one hour. Please take out some time. Never say that I don't have time. You have to take out. This is the right time. And after 50, after 61, after 70 also, you will be very healthy. So start from 40 years. Focus on the exercises and yoga. And second thing is that hydrate yourself. Most of the time we don't drink water. We don't focus on liquids, but this is the right age. You have to focus on liquids also. Water most of the time, if you feel thirsty, you will go and drink water. Otherwise, you won't touch it. It's not like that. Every one hour, take one glass of water or at least one and a half hours. Every one and a half hour, take one glass of water. So that is much required because liquids are much required for the body. Water, consuming water much and include some liquids like buttermilk, coconut water, fruit juices. If not fruit juices, I would advise you to go for direct consuming of fruits. Any fruits, seasonal fruits you can take. Because it includes lots of fiber. So that is why. So please hydrate yourself, fruits and liquids. Try to take much. This will be definitely helpful for us. Third thing is that hygienic sattvic food you have to take. When you were young, like below 30 years, below 20 years, whatever you had, digestion system used to accept junk food, this and that, what not, you, you have dumped everything, accepted, digested. But after 40 years, your digestion system will not accept, your tummy is not going to accept, accept this fact. You have to realize it. So what your tummy is accepting, that kind of food you have to take daily. Make that kind of food at, as part and parcel of your life. Sattvic food, vegetarian food, cool food, less spices, less oil, less salt. Please, you have to. So this is going to give you long and healthy life, less problems. You can protect yourself from the problems. So hygienic sattvic food. And the fourth thing, thing is that mental fitness. This is much important, mental fitness. How do you make yourself mentally strong? If you are mentally strong, physical fitness also automatically it will cooperate. Exercises, mental fitness, both are there means you can handle anything, yes, anything. So, mental fitness, few things I will tell you. First thing is that you need to have somebody to talk, somebody to share your feelings. Maybe your friends, parents, sibling, or wife, husband, kids, somebody. Somebody is close to you. So, sharing is important. While sharing, if you share anything, so your mind will relax a lot, you get a kind of consoling and sometimes you may get some kind of advices also. So you get a confidence, yes, somebody is with me. So that is going to make you mentally more strong. 
so sharing and having confidence of others and uh, talking to someone so this is important and also emotionally you need to be strong when you get problems never break yourself always tell to yourself few encouraging words problem is common okay this time i'm having problem but after some period no more problems this problem i wanted to face it i have to handle it i have to clear it if not ignore it it's not in my hand time will solve all these problems like you tell yourself few positive words that will keeps yourself emotionally strong and recreation also please have some recreation don't work like an ox if i'm not using wrong word after 40 especially we focus only on our professional life work 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 no so recreation is also important keep some time for your personal life have some fun with your family have some fun with your friends like you have to keep some time uh, i'm not asking you to take out a few days like one week or 10 days or one month no as per your uh, work work environment as per your schedule is fixed take out at least one hour have fun with your family go to outing or half day a movie at least park do park anything whatever is possible so plan in that way so have some good gatherings take some any occasion like birthday marriage day or otherwise any other achievements you need just excuse to celebrate that's all so in that way recreation please plan and also i would advise you to go for some games also it, it may be indoor games or outdoor games indoor games like caroms chess sudoku puzzle solving and this kind of things it will prevent all kind of alzheimer problems outdoor games it will give you fitness mental fitness and also physical fitness so games you can plan so that is also advisable so like you can have lots of variety of items variety of ways to keep yourself mentally strong fourth point is this and last one fifth one is that always go for periodical checkups after 40 years every time at least a uh, uh, half year means yearly twice after 6 months please go for health checkup if anything is there always remember early detection is always better you can have easily treatment for any kind of problems you can be alert and uh, you can have preventions you can have medicines anything is possible so that is why so periodical checkups you can go apart from this five i wanted to give you one bonus tip before bonus tip shall i give you recap okay please note down first thing is that exercises and the yoga you have to keep one hour second thing hydrate yourself and uh, third one also starting with h hygienic sattvic food you take and fourth one mental health and fifth one regular periodical checkups that's it now coming to the bonus tip uh, you have to keep some kind of entertainment laughing is must and compulsory for you the more you laugh you become very fresh and you'll have a uh, muscle exercises on your face it will give you glow it will give you some kind of peace of mind you'll forget all your tensions you'll forget all your problems you'll forget all your stress depression everything is matashed because of laughing what to do madam i don't know how to laugh i don't have any other sources to laugh don't tell me such kind of thing there are many sources you can watch a comedy movie comedy shows you can watch and uh, fun chatting with your friends fun talk you can have over the phone you can meet and you can crack jokes with your friends and the best one is that have company of children just spend time with them listen to them what they are saying they have their own stories listen to them then after that you interact with them in a funny way have a good relation with children so that is a big big stress buster <laughs> you love you will be cool you can handle your mind also simple these are the life principles if you follow easy one more important point i forgot to share with you when you talk to your uh, juniors or children 
so don't expect any kind of respect from them never show that uh, i am elder i you you have to give respect to me and don't demand respect you just be friendly cool way handle them smiling face give them guidance in a friendly way when you talk automatically you get the respect respect is in such a way that uh, you cannot demand it comes automatically with our attitude please remember this point if anything is serious don't take anything serious in your mind and heart cool small life nothing is serious nothing is permanent so what is this problem what is this nonsense somebody said something somebody did something nonsense it should not hurt you that is why i would advise you to practice daily yoga breathing exercises meditation so that nothing can touch you nothing can harm you so you'll be very strong mentally physically it is possible did you see our elders 70 plus 80 plus years also there is some glow on their face cool always for small petty things we get a lot of tension but they never it's their experience it's their lifestyle we must learn all these things are you happy with this talk okay do let me know whatever from your side life principle do let me know from your side also i'm ready to hear i'm ready to accept i'll follow it also so thank you everyone for spending your valuable time for sharing your good wishes and blessings and next time i'll come up with another interesting topic till that period always keep smiling keep shining and stay healthy stay fit good luck